Give them back. Those eggs don't belong to you. That was much easier than I thought it would be. Man, I hard to believe they just ran away. I'm not sure they were running from you. Lonnie, what are you doing up there? Keeping away from them. Looky here. Exotic food. Ooh, fancy and tasty. Esteban, nobody messes with our friends. Why not, Ronnie? Shh, Lonnie, back me up here. Okay. Listen to their adorable little hiss. What you gonna do? Spit at us? <sighs> Smart. You will stay away from my whipping tail. Fine. Forget it. We'll find food elsewhere. Oh, you boys did real good. <laughs> yeah. How did we know how to do that? Because that's what Nile monitor lizards do. You're used to defending yourselves from lions. Hmm. I reckon you fellers are gonna be all right. Especially if you stick together. I told you, everything was fine. Hey, this place, maybe not so bad. Nothing here we can't handle. Of course, you're all back where you belong. Now, let's get these eggs back where they belong. Oh, do we have to? <laughs> so, those silly monitor lizards managed to fit in after all. Yep, I should have known I couldn't stop them fellers from getting into trouble in their new home. But I sure feel better knowing they can get themselves out of it just fine. <laughs> Careful now, could be a mermaid. Or a sea monster's pale cream. I'd say these eggs belong to a harlequin duck. And as sure as eggs is eggs, a mother duck wouldn't let her nest just float away. We need to find her. A vast, matey. Don't want you getting lost in all this fog. Let's take a buddy with you. I'll go. All right, then. We'll find the mum. And I'll stay here and look after her nest. Hush, little eggies, don't you crack. You say, there's a life rough with Calico Jack. You're fragile uh -huh. and delicate and pale as snow. Uh -huh. Oh, did you say? According to my bird book, harlequin ducks are usually found near pounding surf. Check. And rocky shores. I'd say we're in the right place, but not safe from coastal erosion. Good point. Let me see. Coastal erosion, landslides. Whoa! Oh! 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 Yeah. If you put your book down, matey, you'll see there's coastal erosion right in front of you. Good idea. Wait for me. Sleep, little chicky. Soon you walk, then you fly, and your beaks will. Ah! Yes, Pete, that's the line, but not so loud. We don't want them to hatch just yet. <laughs> Ahoy there! Now, if Tracker were here, he'd know what kind of bird you are. Uh, a raven. Ah, of course you are. Uh, oh, you have eggs. Uh, uh. Just watch it over them for someone. You're a bird. How would you take care of a nest full of eggs? Oh, I have lots of ideas. Ah. Now, because of its colorful feathers, the harlequin duck has lots of other names. It's sometimes known as the painted duck, the totem duck, the glacier duck. You got your nose in that book again? Nope. I've got it all up here. Well, I've been around the world and I know what a duck looks like. There's our mother duck. Morning! Uh, now, not to worry, but we found your nest and it's perfectly safe. So, uh, if you'd like to follow me, madam. Who are you calling madam? She's got a deep voice. Uh, that's a male. See his colorful feathers? No, what we're looking for is a lot more brown and a lot more like her. <coughs> Morning, madam. You are a madam, aren't you? Uh, yes. Just checking. Are you missing a nest of eggs? 
Yes! Yes! <gasps> She's sinking! Don't worry, we'll save her. Oh. Hey! Whoa! Oh, you okay, Pa? Yeah, oh, it's just, uh, oh, I didn't know the cupcake could go underwater like this. I've lived in the Everglades my whole life, but I've never been under its waters. It's amazing. Sure is. But I don't see the armadillo. <laughs> Looks like I outsmarted that big old gator. <gasps> well, well. Looky here, Earl. <laughs> You're safe now. All the gators are gone. What about the big gator that swallowed me? Oh, that wasn't a gator. That was the cupcake. See? I built her. Sorry we scared you. Oh, <laughs> I guess I am a little jumpy. Ever since I came to this part of the Everglades, there's been gators chasing me. By the way, I'm Lucille. I'm Tweet, and this is Dashy. We're Octonauts, and this here is my pa. Ranger Marsh, ma'am. Glad to meet you. Lucille, we need to return this turtle egg to its nest. I took it because I was hungry. My home was burned in the fire. Everything got covered in ash, so I had to look for food somewhere else. We armadillos use our noses to hunt for our favorite foods. Bugs and worms. But all that ash makes it tough to sniff around. Hmm. Think I just might have an idea. Oh, stop! Right there! Right there was my home. Lovely place before all this ash covered it. Don't worry. Dashy, turn the gup around. Hold on to your hat, Pa! <laughs> She's gone! Oh, thanks! Now I'll be able to find enough bugs and worms to feed all of us. <laughs> no way. Uh, uh, just eight! <laughs> None for us, thanks. <laughs> Suit yourselves. Just a little more. Perfect! Thanks, Dashy. Oh, this is wonderful. Such a beautiful, healthy tree. Thanks for your help, Octonauts. I say, Tweak, does the Terragup have an instruction manual? It sure does, Professor. Right below the console. Why? I'm being pursued by some very persistent howler monkeys. I told them they had to move to a new tree and they didn't take it at all well. Keep them moving, Inky. Maybe we can lead them to a healthy part of the forest. I agree. Moving seems to be the best plan. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ah, when traveling up steep inclines, make sure the primary graspers are engaged. Oh, well, that goes without saying. You know, I think I'm getting the hang of it. Oh! Hey! Why are you chasing us? What? That can't be right. After him! Ooh, 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 ooh. You're doing great, Inky. Follow that branch to the next tree. Uh, I'm afraid that branch doesn't quite reach anymore. But I have an idea. Well, I'll be. Brilliant, Inky. Now the howlers can run across to their new home. <laughs> oh, but it will not work. We're not leaving now. With my apologies, we must once again force you to leave. You're trying to knock the Terrica five out of the tree. <laughs> leave our friends alone. Fine. We know better than to mess with harpy eagles. Ooh, how dare you chase us into a new tree with more leaves and plenty to eat and, uh, ooh, better places to sleep. Maybe we should just stay. Oh, right. 
Uh, actually, we will take this tree too. So, with uh, apologies, it is ours now. So, uh, I guess, thank you. Not a moment too soon. I just hope we can last until Dashie and Pearl get back here. What do you mean, my team? Look at it. It's rock solid. Maybe solid enough for that wave, but they keep getting bigger. Octonauts, race the barrier. I hope Dashie gets here soon. What in the world is happening? The storm we were trying to warn you about. It's finally hit, Katie. Oh, dear. We hate storms. Always, always have, have, always will. Attention, Albatross! Follow us! Shiver! Whiskers! There's nowhere to go! Nowhere to go, but up! Aha! As I was saying, follow us to your new nesting ground! You heard him, everybody! We always stick with our eggs. Always have, always will. Uh, excuse me, are you all right there? Uh, uh, oh, hello. I flew all the way out here to get these sand deals to feed my puffling. But now, I'm too tired to fly back. Papa? I think my friend here may have already fed your puffling. Could you take a look? Oh, yes. That's my baby. Thank you. Ever since the water got warmer, I've had to fly so much farther from the colony to find these sand eels. We'd be happy to fly you back there. Perhaps you could help us as well. We're searching for a pair of puffins who left the colony early. You mean Solvik and Ingvar? Too bad about their egg not hatching. Well, now it appears that their egg will hatch, and soon. That's wonderful news. You know, I saw them back where I found these sand eels. I can take you to them. You want this puffin egg? Catch! Huh? No egg, you tricked me. Yes, that I did. <gasps> hey, look out! Uh, oh, 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 my wing! Hooray, Quasi! You saved us! I guess you octonauts really are here to help. Uh, uh, I just wanted to scare the scallywag away. I didn't want to hurt him. Pacer, can you help him? Of course, but I'll need someone to keep this egg warm. Ah, fine, matey. I'll keep the little fellow warm. Here, Mr. Go. That should take care of your wing. And this should take care of your stomach. Oh, 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 thank you. Much tastier than that rock. Peso, Quasi, good news. We found the missing parents and we're on our way back to the colony. Better hurry, Captain. This egg's gonna hatch real soon. Oh, I still can't believe it. Our egg has a chick in it after all. We can't thank you, Octonauts, enough for finding us. Bjorn? Oh, you came back! And you brought sand eels for our puzzling. Oh, Helga. I missed you. Oh, ah, oh she's hatching! Who are you? Hey, hey, hey! What are you doing with our egg? It's all right. He's a hero. He saved us all from a hungry girl. Mama! 
What? Me? No, 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 no. Hey, I, I'm just your matey. Here's your mum. Mama! To the Octoray. Wow, look at that. I'm Captain Barnacles. I like to go with the flow. Above and beyond. <laughs>